All right. Now, Eric Miller, I have known for four years. Errol Miller and I we were on the road together. Eric Miller is a jazz guitarist. Eric Miller is an intellect. Eric Miller has good taste, because it's my good taste. Maybe not your good taste. Dig, there's another switch a bit. But I dig Eric Miller. Eric and I work together in Miami. He sang, and I talk. Then I say, Eric, want to do a bit with me? Well, that's not my stick talking, but OK. We'll do a bit, and we'll ad-lib it, and fool around with it. And we did a bit, and then the bit found form. And it got flaps. We're at the party now. And Eric being colored, he would be a musician. There are very few integrated parties, which does not make the people who do not have colored people at the parties bigoted. Because you don't know colored people to invite them as props as Crow Jim. <laughs> <laughs> now, parties and swing, and the humor comes from the now becoming obscure white person's concept of how do you relax colored people at parties? And in the bit, I play the white guy. <laughs> oh, and how I'm party here. Yes, I'm enjoying myself. I'm pissed at ears, I tell you. <laughs> oh, boy, I like a pig. Oh, I had a wonderful time. Oh, I really stopped myself. Oh, boy, I tell you. I didn't get your name. Miller. Miller, my name is Anderson. Anderson, glad to know you. Pleasure indeed, sir. Mm -hmm. Pleasure indeed. <laughs> you know that Joe Lewis was a hell of a fighter. <laughs> yeah, 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 you can say that again. Joe Lewis was a hell of a fighter. Credit to your race. Don't you forget it, you son of a gun. Well, thank you very much. That's uh, perfectly all right. Uh, here's the Bojangles. Yeah, here's the Bojangles. <laughs> I used to watch him on the television all the time, eh? Uh -huh. uh, uh, them show people are all right. Um, I guess you know a lot of people in the show business, huh? Yeah, quite a few in my travels. Uh, what the hell is that? I'm bad on names. Uh, Aunt Jemima. <laughs> no, no, I don't know Aunt Jemima. Uh, what the hell is that guy? Uh, you know that guy in a cream of wheat box? <laughs> no, I don't know him on the cream of wheat box. Oh, uh, well. Here's the step and fetcher. Yeah, here's the step and fetcher. <laughs> he ruined himself, though. Coca Cola and white women did it to him. <laughs> yeah. Probably had a good career. You know, uh, I did all the construction here. Oh, you did? Yeah, I did all the paint. And these heaps. You're not Jewish, are you? No. <laughs> No offense, you know what I mean? Yeah. Someone call me a heap, I'm knocking right in the rear. Like that, you know? As long as you understand, you know? I mean, what the I mean, uh, I don't know how you feel about them integrating stuff. I mean, uh, I, don't, I don't care what the hell a guy is, as long as he keeps in his place, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's how I feel about it. Here's to uh, all the color people. Yeah. Well, anyway. I start in here, and these mocks are Jewish people now. They say to me, wait a minute. So he says, look, darling, what you going to do, darling? You going to put the paint up here. But you guys Chinese, I do all that stuff too. Uh, anyway, uh, look at this color he picked up. Is that ridiculous? No, I don't think so. I think that's very interesting how they use the doofy blue with so many other pastel. That sounds like a lot of commie horse shit to me. <laughs> Doofy Blue. Yeah, the Doofy Blue. Is that what they call it? You're all right. You're a white Jew, you son of a gun. I like it. You're okay. You know, I just realized something. What's that? I'm integrating and touching you, for Christ's sake. <laughs> See that? If I didn't touch you, you're all right. You're all right. You're all right, you son of a gun. You're okay. Thank you, Alec. Like you're too. all right. Listen, do you get anything to eat yet? No, I'm kind of hungry. I wish I had a sandwich or something. Oh, boy. You know, you gotta, you gotta eat before you drink. I always take a teaspoon of olive oil, you know? <laughs> That's what you do. And then you can drink all night. I'm really getting pissed, I'm telling you, boy. <laughs> well, look. As long as you drink this stuff, you stay away from drugs. <laughs> That's right. Look. You know what? 
I'm going to get you something to eat. I don't know if there's any fried chicken here. Uh, watermelon, but... Uh, I'll get something you like. And I'll get them a lot for you. I'll get you all the watermelons in the world. Because <laughs> I love you. That's right. I'll get you all the watermelons and a fried chicken in the world. I'll sing a song about the fried chickens and the watermelon in the world. Mmm, we'll get you all the fried chicken and the watermelon in the world. All the watermelon in the world. All the watermelon in the world. Thank you. Here's to Paul Robeson. <laughs> you know, I'd like to have you over the house. Well, thank you. I'd like to come over. Tonight, Dad, it'll be dark soon. Uh... <laughs> Oh. I'll never go to the house. Look, you can come over my house if you promise you don't do it to my sister. Look, you don't want no he plowing your sister. And I don't want no coon doing it to my sister, that's all. You can understand that, can you? It doesn't make any difference to me just as long as he's a nice Come on, what do you want, a weed or something? All right? Okay. Okay. Here's to the Mau Maus. 